Poljska je površinom 5,5 puta veća od Hrvatske i u njoj živi 40 milijuna stanovnika. U Europsku uniju ušli su 2004. godine. O poljskom uspjehu i savjetima Hrvatskoj razgovarali smo s glasnogovornikom Ministarstva regionalnog razvoja Republike Poljske, Piotrom Popom. So, which are the funds you are mostly proud of and that have been co-founded by EU funds? We can uh, boast about our infrastructural projects and now two, two thirds of our um, highway network has been completed. Uh, the other thing that, I, uh, that in my opinion should be noted that uh, European funds uh, helped to create 250,000 jobs, uh, 150,000 uh, of which were created by people who were previously unemployed. So uh, it shows that uh, European funds clearly, clearly strengthens the, the job market. And uh, the, other, uh, the other things that um, are also worth noting is that uh, we uh, have managed to uh, strengthen our um, uh, educational and um, uh, innovative in infrastructure as well as um, helping uh, connecting, connecting it with business to make our innovations enter the market and serve the people. And what's, what's your advice how to improve small enterprises, how to open uh, new work positions? First of all, um, uh, what, what should be noted is that um, uh, we concentrate on uh, people who have more difficulty entering job market like graduates or uh, people aged 50 plus. And uh, what we did, we uh, provide the uh, whole ecosystem for them to uh, help, uh, help them start, uh, start a job, uh, create their own enterprise and move it onto the market. So half a year ago, we, uh, we visited, um, with journalists, we visited a cafe which was established by an by a, uh, almost 60-year-old uh, lady who, um, who, was, uh, who had to quit her job due to health uh, issues. And she started a small uh, arts cafe where you can not only sip a cup of coffee, but you can, you can enjoy lecture on, on arts. You, you can try yourself in painting or sculpture. And she, uh, she started this business completely from scratch. She, she knew nothing about uh, running any sort of business because she had never done this in her life. So in the end, uh, can you give us a small advice or just a tap on the, on the, on the shoulder? Should we be afraid or not? Plenty of changes will happen around you, but the most important change which has happened, in my opinion, has taken place in people's heads because uh, you need to change people's mentality. You, it, European money shows that uh, people, people can take this can-do attitude and start their own business and use these funny for, funds for their own benefits because it did change uh, some people's uh, lives uh, completely. So I think, I think what, what is necessary is to find the areas which you think uh, could be, first of all, uh, the ones that, that, that require uh, that, uh, heavy investments and uh, the ones which you think could be your strength.